In this video, we are going to take a look at one more type of addition reaction, and that is with the polymerization of alkenes. So if you have a large number of alkenes, in this case, when we're talking about polymerization, where they're called monomers, they can be joined together through an addition reaction. So just the carbon-carbon double bond is reacting and breaking and joining these monomers together n number of times to create a polymer chain. So really important here to keep or, or to note that the R groups are not affected. They are basically becoming the branches on your polymer chain and it's just this carbon-carbon double bond that's reacting and the bonds are breaking, so creating single bonds and creating a polymer chain. So just taking a look at an example, this is an example of polyvinyl chlorides or PVC for short. This particular uh, polymer is made up of chloroethene monomers. And if you take n number of these, you can create a polychloroethene um, polymer or polyvinyl chloride is what its uh, common name is called. Now, this is just kind of showing you a very condensed version of this polymer, but essentially in this chain down here, this is expanded out and you can see one, two, three, four, five different monomers here. So this would be a monomer, uh, but the chain mon o can't spell monomer, there we go. And this would be a chain of many, many monomers joined together. So essentially to recognize a monomer in a polymer chain, you're looking for the repeating unit. And to draw the monomer then, you're taking the repeating unit and you're putting it back into this form with a double bond. Um, and then if you were given this particular molecule, to get it to here, you're essentially joining them together. You're putting this up and this down, this up and this down, and uh, creating just all singly bonded carbons. So essentially, um, kind of the key points here is you need to be able to recognize the monomer, the repeating unit, to be able to join you know, three or four monomers together in a polymer chain and to represent that for pretty much any alkene that uh, you are given. So that's it for the polymerization reaction of alkenes. That's it for this video. We'll see you in the next one.